Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna be going so hard tonight. Uh-huh. Okay, well, I'll see ya. Okay, bye. Whoa, well, hello, I didn't notice you guys there. Thanks for watching. It's really adorable that you guys are trying to learn how to get girls like me. How did that compliment I just gave you make you feel? If you think about it, it's a little backhanded. A little insulting. But it also probably makes you want to prove me wrong. I bet you guys are going to try even harder now to be more assertive and more manly. So even though you might not like it, that compliment served a purpose. It helped motivate you to do something. Now let's learn how we can use that to our advantage. How to get girls. Lesson number 32. Negging. Negging. When a person makes a deliberate backhanded compliment or otherwise insulting remark to another person in order to undermine his or her confidence in a way that makes that person eager to please. This is a good way to get girls. After tearing down their self-confidence and making them want to impress you, you can use their newfound vulnerability to manipulate them into dating you or having sex with you. Whichever one you want, because remember, this is all about you. Now that we've explained what negging is and its uses, let's take a look at a step-by-step -step example. It's really very easy. Step 1. Approach a girl and neg. Hey, girl. Oh, hi. What's your name? I'm Heather. I'm Trevor. Nice to meet you, Trevor. Nice to meet you, too. You know, I really like your style. I love how you can not care about how you look and be okay with it, you know? You look like you're on a diet. That's great. I think it's really impressive that a girl like you has self-confidence. Step 2. Watch her already fragile self-esteem come tumbling down. Hey, sorry, I just need to use the bathroom. Okay. I'll be right back. Oh my god, I must look awful, and I'm probably acting like an idiot. Do these pants make me look fat? And oh, my hair is such a mess. I wonder how anyone would ever want to talk to me when I look this bad. Everyone probably thinks I'm annoying and stupid and... But at least Trevor's talking to me. At least he doesn't think I'm totally hideous and unlikable. Or at least not yet. Maybe there's still hope. If I try, maybe he'll like me. Maybe. Step 3. Use her new vulnerability to make her do whatever you want. Hey, I'm back. Oh, uh, hey. Wanna come back to my place? Yeah, sounds good. Okay, let me just check to make sure my roommate's not in my room, because I don't really want to be seen with you. Remember, boys, the first thing to do is find a woman who looks like she'll be vulnerable. Then you say something that seems complimentary, but really makes her feel bad about herself. This makes you look like you don't care about her, which will cause her to internalize the insult and try to impress you. Once you see this happening, use her desire to please to your advantage. The dating game is all about satisfying your desires, and nigging is good to have in your tool belt. Some people say it takes two to tango, but these people have obviously never learned how to properly interact with a woman. Now that we've learned how to nag, you guys are ready to go out there and try it yourselves.